Hey guys, so I moved to a new location in the house and I think the sliding may be a little more to your liking. So I'm starting off with this primer from e.l.f. and it's just their sheer primer. Just put that on my lid and blend it in with my finger. Hey, how did I get that on the other side of my finger? So I'm going to use my Wet n Wild Vanity Palette. I love this. And I'm going to use the dark bronze color right down there. And to apply, I'm using the e.l.f. eyeshadow brush. And I'm just applying this to the first two-thirds of my eye. So just like this. This look is so quick, you guys. So, just like that, maybe zoom in just a little bit more. Alright, then I'm going to take my Hip Duo in Brazen, Focus, Brazen, and there's this really pretty dark brown chocolatey color in there, and I'm just going to use that on a e.l.f. eye crease brush and start applying that right on the outside and just start working it into the crease but then kind of make like a v-shape on the outside with it outside your eye just like this like i said just kind of work it over to blend it and then just work it in the crease also, like so. Then connect it to the edge here and drag it underneath the eye, but not too far over. Now I'm gonna take this Studio Tools, uh, what is this? It's a crease brush, but I like using it as a blending brush and blend out the line here. Now I'm gonna use a little bit of my Milani bronzer. I like using this to like blend out my colors on my eyes cause it's still a little bronzy but still goes well with my skin tone. So I just use that to get rid of any harsh lines. And I'm not gonna add a highlight to this look simply because I used a lighter concealer under my eye in order to like naturally highlight it so if you want to add a little more depth to the crease you can use this dark color here in the vanity palette and just go back into the crease and just kind of darken it up if you want to it's optional if you want to add a little bit of a highlight in there I would suggest um, mixing like these two colors so a little bit of both and just right here. All right. Now you can proceed with adding some eyeliner. I'm going to use um, a gel and just create somewhat of a thin line. Not too thick. And then I'm just going to wing out on the outside. Now I'm just going to add these lashes from e.l.f. And these are the instantly intensify lush lashes. Alright, I have my lash on. Never mind that glue because that's going to dry clear. So I'm just going to add some mascara to my bottom lashes. Okay, so that glue is drying, but after it dries, I'm going to use my eyelash curler to curl my lash. And for the rest of my face, I'm going to use um, a little bit of this Princess Bronzer. This is from Wet n Wild. I'm going to use this on this uh, Duo Fiber face, face Brush from Crown Brush that I got from Outlook.
To give my face just a tad bit of color on the cheeks, I'm going to use um, this blush from Milani called Coralina. It's really pretty. Let's get that on here. Put that right on my apples. This brush is really nice. This is my first time using it. On my lips, I already had some liner on with a little bit of gloss from e.l.f., but I think I'm going to go over it with um, Ferris Nude from L'Oreal. And I guess I'll put more of a pink gloss over it, so I'm going to use this uh, Hyper Shine Gloss from... It's in Berry Cherry, and it's from e.l.f. This is a dollar. Sounds like somebody's party. And so these are the finished eyes. You guys saw how super duper quick and easy that was. And my cheeks. And then my lips. Alright, so this is the finished look. This is the final look that you get. You can see that was super duper easy. Um, of course, if you want to smoke it out a little bit more or whatever, you can add some black into like your outer V and drag it down along the outside. And then you can add like some um, black on your waterline and stuff. But um, I, don't, I don't want it to be too dramatic. So it's for me, it's more of a wearable look. But if you guys want to do that, you can go right ahead. So um, that's it for this look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And that's about it. I'll see you all later.